What's up guys, this is Joey Jacob bringing you another video about the Audi trailer. So in this video, I just wanted to go over one of the things that I had done on the Audi trailer and also show you the new large piece of the puzzle that I've been trying to find for a little while for the Audi trailer. Okay, so one of the things I got done on the Audi trailer was that I got the rear uh, windows and rear windshield tinted. I got them tinted by Nathan Smith. He works at a Port Huron and he was able to come by and tent the trailer for me. I am still waiting on material to tent the side windows, the front side windows and the front window. I figured out that tent does not stick to polycarbonate and I am ordered some taillight tint to put on the front side windows and the front window so that it will also look tinted and match the rest of the Audi trailer. Okay, so the other big piece of the Audi trailer that I finally was able to find was a set of wheels. As you can see, they're right here. Um, if you saw my Instagram, I was trying to trick people thinking I got some BC forged wheels, but they are actually... One second. They are actually Vossens. They are Vossen VLE1s, number 381 out of 400. I now own two sets out of 400 of these wheels, and I think that's pretty cool. And I am going to mock them up and see how well they fit on the Audi trailer. The closest I can get the wheel to the fender to get mocked up and fitment seems pretty good. Um, as you can see, there's probably like a centimeter or two uh, more poke than the rear fender. And I will mess with the camber adjustments to see if I can uh, make these wheels tuck. And if not, I will have to do some more heavier suspension work to make them tough. Okay, so I played with the camber adjustment a little bit and this is the best I could get. We have like a centimeter more to tuck the wheels. And I will have to do some more suspension work to like make some custom camber arms for this so that the wheel will be able to tuck. Okay, so now I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side and see how it goes. So I got the new wheels test fitted on the Audi trailer. Fitment seems pretty good. I'm gonna have to do a little bit more suspension work to make them tuck. But um, now let's move on to tinting the front side windows and front window with the tail light tint I just got in today. And we can start that right now.
All right, so I got all the windows tinted. I ended up tinting both sides of the piece of Lexan. And I did that because I tinted one side and then I went outside to check how dark it was compared to the existing window tint and it wasn't dark enough. So I decided to double tint uh, the windows with one layer of tint on each side. And it matches up pretty well with the uh, how the windows are tinted currently on the Audi trailer. So now that we have all the window windows tinted, we can go install them into the Audi trailer. So before I install the windows, I actually have to filler seal the Audi trailer. I'm gonna spray some sealant on the front and everywhere else where I body work. And then after that, we can get to installing the windows. <laughs> So I got two coats of filler sealer on the Audi trailer. Um, I'm just gonna let it dry for a little bit and then we can work on installing the windows. So I got all the windows installed into the Audi trailer and now I'm going to seal everything to make sure everything is watertight and that no water can get into the Audi trailer. sealed as you can see I put it along all the edges in the inside and then on the bottom I put it in between the piece of polycarbonate and the outside of the door so I uh, keep water out that way and I attached the front window and sealed that as you can see and then I also did the same on this window sealed it all the way around on the inside and then did the bottom on the outside of the window keep water out and yeah so that's pretty much it for sealing the windows uh, and now I'm going to move on to routing the sunroof drain tubes somewhere where they can drain and not get water inside of the trailer so I got the drain tubes ran out of the trailer it was actually a lot easier than I thought it didn't take very long 
but I think that is it for today's video. Um, if you, you enjoyed this video, feel free to give it a like. Don't forget to share, comment, and subscribe, and hit the bell to be notified when I post new videos. And this has been Joey Jacobs, and I will see you in the next one.